Kentucky will have a statewide smoking ban within the next five years. And that's what the state's public health commissioner is predicting. It's one of the many talking points at today's summit on public smoking policy in Owensboro. News 25's Corey Allen has new details live in the Owensboro newsroom. Corey? Yeah, Brad, it's hard to imagine with tobacco such a cash crop banning smoking across Kentucky, but more communities are outlawing it. The Breathing Clean Air Summit started with a breathtaking comment from Kentucky Department for Public Health Commissioner Dr. William Hacker. Looking at the pattern, as every year we pick up more and more communities, I'm hoping that within the next five years, if not sooner, that the state will uh, implement a statewide uh, smoking ordinance. Davis County already has a public smoking ban in place. Hacker says as half the state is closing in on community smoking bans, the pressure at the state level will force it for serious consideration. Adults shouldn't smoke, kids shouldn't smoke, and I would recommend no one smoke. But if you do smoke, you shouldn't be contaminating the air that non-smokers are with, is, uh, sharing with you. Representatives from Ohio County Smoke Free are trying to get a similar ordinance passed. The ordinance could soon be presented to the Ohio County Fiscal Court. I don't know of any community that's ever uh, enacted a, a smoking ban that's ever uh, reneged on it. It actually works and there are dramatic results. Uh, uh, admission rates for heart attacks and respiratory diseases uh, have been shown to uh, drop by as much as uh, 30 to 40 percent after the, uh, the bans are, are enacted. Hacker says tobacco growing has decreased over the last 30 years. No longer the cash crop it once was. As smoking has decreased nationally, the numbers of growers have decreased. So the, the small tobacco farmer today is not nearly as prevalent as though they were 30 or 40 years ago. And many Kentuckians opposing a smoking ban say it violates their personal liberties. Live in the Owensboro Newsroom, Corey Allen, News 25.